Now I claim that this channel is old school Call of Duty with a new school twist. And oh boy, does that statement not get any truer today. So we're starting off on raid and when I spawn Gary side I always take that route when I just whiff a grenade completely and go down the left hand side, pop through the middle, catch somebody out who's trying to push forward through the dead center of the map. And this game starts off fine. It starts off great in fact, I was having a really really good time. Then about halfway through, the whole game goes to a sweet new level of hell. Like I'm wrong, gameplay's fine. There are some moments in this game which I completely whiff which I just kind of left in for well shits and giggles purposes more than anything because it's funny when you fuck up in it but oh boy the oh boy so I don't know how it's going to come across visually because when I was editing out oh two AFKers don't mind if I do I, I need all the help I can get I don't know how this is going to come across visually whatsoever because when I was editing, I kind of thought, oh, it didn't look that bad. Oh, certain moments, like, oh, gee whiz, that, that's, that's nasty. Speaking of gee whiz, a nasty motherfucker, you hide in there, little prick. Anywho, so, Raid, talking about connections. Oh, we are back in 2012, aren't we? Because halfway through this game, the connection went to absolute toffee. I'm not judging anybody of coming in. Oh, this pants are wet, are No, 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 no. This was just probably because I was playing Cold War at 11 o'clock at night and not many people were on and it was kind of forcing me to further and further away just to get a game. And <laughs> don't get me wrong, I enjoyed it and the, the game worked out fine. But oh my god, it felt awful. Just awful. And not the case of. Hit markers, hit markers, hit markers. There was definitely a point when I was pulling out the hand cannon and that, then it kind of went to a sweet new level of hell. But it just felt slow. It felt slow. I don't know what the hell that kill was, but I'll take it. I'll take them in any way and shape or form that I can get because I suck. But I don't know, like, say, if it was a hit marker thing, connection thing, whatever. But it felt like I was just running in molasses the whole time. I was running in molasses. I was trying to have to lead my shots. It was kind of as if, like, where the bullet registers and where the person was were at two completely separate locations. And the reload, oh my god, the reload! You know the connection's bad when you're pressing reload and nothing happens for like half a second and then all of a sudden it just kind of wakes up and gets into life. And my internet's fine. It's, it's rare that I have connection issues on Call of Duty nowadays. It's not like the Black Ops 2 days or the Modern Warfare 3 days, the original ones, where it was all P2P connections and it was absolute sweet new level of hell at times. It, it's just not that bad anymore. But this was, this was, this, this took me past. I, I was kind of even thinking we're going to have a host migration at some point. You know, like really, really get in there with that vibe. And it's something that I've never truly understood about the connections in Call of Duty, because it's only recently it's got better. You know, it's only in the past few years it's got better. I remember when, like, Battlefield 4 was king. And the connections on that game were always super solid. It was super smooth. And it always had so much more going on. It was just, I don't know whether it's an Activision thing or it's just a Treyarch thing. Because I've never had, really had many issues in Infinity Ward games. Even way back when, Modern Warfare 3, the original, probably being the only exempt from that. But it always seems as if Treyarch, it always seems as if you're a split second behind. Like, it always seems that little bit off, and I, I don't know what it is. I can never quite put my finger on it, and uh, in Cold War, Cold War, it doesn't really happen. I went to go get a couple of executions there for myself, but that just didn't happen now, did it? And it was always in, like, the Treyarch games where everything kind of felt a little bit, just that little bit behind, and I don't know if it's just how they made the game, it's just the classic Treyarch hit connection. I do not know, but this game just kind of took me back to that old-school feel, that old-school shiver, and... No, I actually fucking enjoyed it, I'm not gonna lie. It was it was frustrating, but I'm kind of thinking, you know, everyone talks about how all the Call of Duties are the best ones, and everyone said, like, nostalgia bait for days, right? And Black Ops 2 was the best, this one was the best, Black Ops 1, whatever, whatever whichever your preference is, whatever, it doesn't matter, at this point it's irrelevant, right? Triple! Oh yeah. Let's see if we get any better with the hand cannon this time, shall we? And it kind of given me that how far have we actually come moment and that's why i enjoyed it so i was kind of thinking you know after this i'm like i'm god i'm god i ain't back in 2012 anymore you know like i'm, I'm glad that's over with now you know, i don't want to go back to them styles of connections and how long did that hand cannon last not very not very completely whiffed it completely fluffed it up 
Anyhow, moving on. We'll, we'll chalk it down to connection. We'll just chalk it down to needle and shit. Like I said, there was times in this game where <laughs> everything seemed to be running fine. It was just those times like you just go to reload or you go to move and it was just like a split second behind and it was weird, man. It really, really was weird. But I was so grateful to have this because like I said, it just kind of made me feel how far we've come. Like, you know, when I play Modern Warfare 3, I don't really have any connection issues. The old school Modern Warfare, oh, apart from the bloody packet loss thing, that, that can spike up for random reasons that I don't know why. You know, Modern Warfare 2, no issues. Very rare that I have an issue with Cold War, Vanguard, Modern Warfare 2019, whatever, which is surprising, really, when you think about it. But it was just this game. It was just the good old Call of Duty was back. And you know what? I'm glad that the old days are behind us. And these people are going to be glad when this game's behind them because we've got a flight to catch. Rubble dub dubs thank you for flying with Bear. The peanuts were stale, chances are you caught COVID on the plane, and we put hepatitis needles in the seats. Thanks for joining me. And, yeah, dude, like I said, it just makes me glad that... Well, firstly, I'm glad for Cold War that your streaks can carry on even if you get knocked off it. That's a nice thing. And it just made me glad that the old school Call of Duty days... It's nice to have a feel for it again, but how the connections are like they were... I can't believe my triple didn't make best play either, by the way. That's just absolutely sacrilege. It just kind of took me back to them old days of playing Call of Duty. And you know what? Some things are best left in the past. 